think uh, uh, I think uh, it's uh, line up uh, okay. So uh, probably I need to three and towards the four. Okay. So at, at this time I'm gonna uh, make the uh, trigger hot icon. I mean trigger hot, okay. and then uh, start the approach. Okay. Four hours and 43 minutes into the spacewalk. Just to remind everybody where we're at, Ms. Tranquilo is on the end of the station's arm holding that 780-pound pump. Mike Hopkins, who's in the all-white suit, is uh, helping along. What they're doing is moving this pump over to where it's going to be stowed, which is on what you'll hear called the POA. It is basically just an attachment point uh, that this pump will be mounted to, and that is where it will stay. screen you see the what we're calling the POA which is the um, uh, receptacle it basically duplicates the end of the uh, robotic arm and it's grabbing a hold of what's on the left side which is the pump module that Rick you see at the bottom left is holding and that adjustable grapple bar the AGB was attached to the pump module and it is now the interface between the pump module and the POA that's holding it in place and Koichi, the arm operator, is not only operating um, the arm to bring Rick and the pump module into the POA, but he also will switch um, screens and then control the POA itself and then uh, activate the snares to wrap around the grapple fixture that is attached to the pump module, and it'll hold it secure in place. Whenever you're working with equipment this big, I mean, you know, obviously we've never been up there, but it, it looks it looks like it'd be a little bit hard to kind of guide this stuff in whenever you're talking about equipment that's that big in nature. It's kind of hard to see. Absolutely, and, and you can see where Rick is. His eyes are now looking right at a pump module. That's the, his view through his helmet camera you're seeing right there. He can't see the grapple fixture, and that's what um, Koichi is looking at through a camera that's mounted on the top side of the POA, and he can see an alignment pin that's helping him give... Uh, directions to Rick as well as his own inputs, Koichi's inputs into the arm to bring the pump module into the POA. Yeah. Looks like they got it secured, so it does. that's uh, good news. Nice job. Four hours and 45 minutes into today's spacewalk, things still going uh, extremely smooth. I didn't feel in the pump module, so I think I'm ready to leave this work site. Okay, copy that, Rick, and uh, we wanted to get your take uh, before you start moving. Um, we're four hours and 46 minutes into the EVA, and uh, we would like to get some work done at the spare out on ESP3. would like to get your thoughts on that. 